Hi guys, it's Nicole here. I'm going to be doing a favorites video and I hope that I am in focus. So I'm going to be talking, trying to, trying to talk very quickly, but I'm not speaking well today. So I'm going to do hair products, face products, and makeup products, just the stuff that I use. And that's my favorites and what I keep on buying over and over. So some of these are empties, some of them are not. So let's get started. With hair, um, I use this every day when I get out of the shower, and this is got to be oil licious. This is a triple oil. It's argan, white grape, and marula, and it's common shine styling oil. It just calms all my frizzy hair because I got a lot of baby hair, and my hair is like really long. It's about past my butt, <laughs> but this is awesome. Works good for me, and um. This is Tresemme Thermal Creations. This is, um, I use this obviously before I blow dry my hair or if I blow dry or curl my hair. Hairspray has to be Aussie Volumized, Volume Hairspray Finish. <laughs> okay, for face washes, I use Cetaphil Oil Control Foam Wash. I use this because I have acne prone skin and very oily skin, so it really helps me. And this is CeraVe foaming facial cleanser. This is empty, but I do use this um, at night before I, when I take my makeup off and it really helps me. If you're wondering what that is, that's eyeliner. I did a previous video, but I deleted it and I had to redo it. So yeah, this is what I'm doing. Um, <clears throat> this is Proactive Oil-Free Moisturizer. I've had the Proactive for a while. I was using it and it seemed like it was making things worse, but I don't have any moisturizers. Well, I do now, but I'm using this up because I don't have any other moisturizers. And this is the Neutrogena Acne Stress Control Toner. I use this every day, at night and in the morning after I wash my face. And this is Neutrogena Acne Treatment, and this is an on-a-spot treatment. It is all gone. I need to buy some more, but I just put this right on my zits that I'm, like at night when I go to sleep and it helps my acne to clear up faster. So let's start with my face makeup. This is the primers. This is the Benefit Professional. I just bought this but holy cow do I love it and I thought it was worth every penny so if you guys don't have this I suggest you buy this. This is a Rimmel Stay Matte Primer. This is, I use this on the days I don't use this. So I'm using this today and I love it so far. It gets the job done. I mean, it, 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 it works as a good base before you put on your foundation. So that's what I use that for. And for concealers, I use the Hard Candy Glamouflage. And this is in the color medium. I and It's a little too dark for my skin, but I put my foundation over it. And I just use that to cover up any redness or pimples or acne scarring that I just don't want to show. And then I use this Instant Age Rewind Brightener Illuminator for days that I feel like highlighting. I'm not highlighted today, but I do use this. <clears throat> this is a CoverGirl 3-in-1 Stay Fabulous Foundation. <laughs> and this is in the color Warm Beige. I use this a lot. I have other foundations, but that is my favorite. Um, this is the Rimmel Stay Matte Powder in Creamy Beige. I use this all over. This is a Hard Candy Heat Wave um, bronzer. I use this almost every day. Um, for blushes, this is the CoverGirl Instant Cheekbones Contouring Blush. I like this because it comes with a highlighter and I'm wearing this today and I'm wearing this blush right now and it's not very noticeable if you have dark colored skin. So I really like this because I blushes, I can't seem to find a blush that works good on my skin. Okay, so on to primer or eyeshadow bases. <laughs> this is a NYX eyeshadow base and this is the skin tone color. I like that. And this is the e.l.f. primer and this is in the color sheer. It was only a dollar I think or two dollars. I don't know. Cheap but it works. And this is Chapstick Classic Medicaid. I can't... Medicated. I can't um, go a day without that. It really helps my lips to not get dry and flaky. I just bought this, but this is a Smashbox Full Exposure Palette. I am wearing it right now, and I really love it. So yeah, that's a favorite, definitely. Eyebrow products. 
before I bought this Anastasia Dip Brow Pomade. This is in the color Ebony. I'm wearing it right now. I love it, by the way. Um, it's a favorite. But before that, I was using the e.l.f. Eyebrow Kit, and this is in the color Medium, and it works really good for me. And I use this on days where I just don't want such a dark eyebrow and uh, more natural looking. But I'm getting better with the Anastasia, as you can tell. <laughs> This is a Sonia Kasia Clear Brow Gel, and I like this just to go right up on my brows after I'm done putting them in. And for eyeliners, I like to use the CoverGirl Ink Kit, and this is in black ink. It does not smudge, as you guys can see. This is what this is. It gets lighter, but it doesn't smear. And this is a H2O Proof Wet n Wild and Ultra Black. I'm wearing it right now, and I love it. It doesn't smear. You need waterproof my... Uh, waterproof um, makeup remover to take it off so I like it. This is a Lash Blast 24 hour in very black and I'm wearing that right now. I don't wear eyelashes every day so this works very well. Um, okay on to this is lips. <laughs> okay this is um, Peach Kiss by Baby Lips and I obviously use it a lot. That's as much I have left. And I wear that every day on days I don't wear lipstick, but today I am wearing lipstick, and this is Lasting Finish by Kate, and I'm wearing it today, and I just love it. It's in the color 14. It's a nude color, I like it, and I'm wearing this lip gloss over it. This is the hmm, Rimmel Stay Glossy lip glosses, and I really like them. They stay on a while, and they're not too sticky, they're just perfect. And this is the Urban Decay De Slick Makeup Setting Spray. And this is what I use just to spray all over my face to help keep me matte throughout the day. Because I am very oily. But I hope you guys like my video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And if you have any um, suggestions as to what kind of videos you would like me to do, please leave a comment below. And I hope you guys liked it. Have a good day and I'll see you guys later. Bye.